Hey everyone, in the diagram, the road is perpendicular to support the beam of, uh, and AB is congruent to CB. What theorem allows you to conclude that AD is congruent to CD? <coughs> so, Basically, what we can say is that by the perpendicular bisector theorem here, that we know that AC is perpendicular to DB. So, uh, AC is perpendicular to DB, and that's by your theorem and yeah, um, I'll just write perpendicular bisector theorem. Um, we also know that AB is congruent to CB. That's given. So we know that DB is a perpendicular, um, that's right, is perpendicular bisector of AC. All right. Now, since D is on the perpendicular bisector of AC, so it's on there. Um, it is, and that's what it needs to, a point is on the perpendicular bisector. So C is on the perpendicular bisector. So is P here. In our case, it's D and B. So since D is a perpendicular bisector of AC here, that means it is equidistance, I'm just reading the theorem, uh, from A and C. <clears throat> so I don't know how to write it, but uh, D is equidistance <coughs> from A and C. And that's because it's on the perpendicular bisector there. So, therefore, this is how you write therefore, the three dots. Therefore, AD equals CD. So, these two equal. Therefore, uh, AD, um, it should have been AD. is congruent to CD. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.